whole point of telematics is at the end of the day, before you send drivers to pick up the chassis or a trailer, you know that it's actually ready to move, right? So the lights and the brakes and the tires are all checked out. Right? This is the only thing on the market that will do that, and you can dispatch drivers after you've remotely pre-checked the asset. And it's installed here for the first time. Uh, this is an example of the screen. And um, this is all still um, under development, but uh, what you have here is a pre-check button that we're gonna hit, and it's gonna check out the, all the systems on the chassis. But we're showing uh, the, the chassis is currently bare. We're showing all the tires for the pressure and temperature from the PSI uh, tire view system. This chassis also has their tire inflation system, so we're monitoring the tire inflation system for uh, the input and output pressures to know that that system is on and working properly. Uh, we're also monitoring for the, the brakes because this chassis has the TSE sense chambers to get the amount of push rod travel on each brake application. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're also monitoring uh, all of the lights through the Philips Industries uh, light sentry product. And we monitor five light circuits, the left turn signal, the right turn signal, the marker lights, the license plate, and the stop. Okay, so when we do a remote pre-check, it's going to go through and test each of these sensors and confirm that, that they're working properly. All right, so uh, here I'll hit pre-check. So I could be sitting at, at my desk, and it's gonna run through and check every light. Watch, watch them all. It's the marker and the license, second one. Come on, man. Yep. And I know it's done when I get the right turn. Right. Yeah. Yep. And here's the last one. So let's check every one out. It comes back, they're all green. If I disconnect the light, it'll come back and show me that it switches from healthy to an alert status. It shows the exact light circuit that's got an issue. Uh, same way on the tire. If we disconnected a uh, tire sensor and we showed the tire at zero pounds, same way, it'll pick it up. Yeah. So. Run it again. That's great. You, yeah, you disconnected my marker? Oh, that's something happened. All right. All right. So, because this is a gooseneck chassis, we put the container on/off sensor here. And all I'm going to do is block. Okay. All right. So I'm just literally like this, and then I'm going to pre-check it. Again. And it's going to switch the, the load status from bare to mated, and it's going to pick up that light that you just. Finished, I'll get a completed note here. Right, and remember, and you're doing this before you're dispatching the driver. So you can, you can do this to your fleet. So you, you just say, it. show me everything at South Boom. There's no more kicking you back into a maintenance line. So I already know it. The guy's not going to pick up a bad order of chassis at Okay, so it's come back now. It's now mated because I showed it blocking the container sensor. Mm -hmm. It shows I've got a, a on this chassis because it's short ground and black. Yeah. It shows a license plate. Yeah, so it knows it's either in the marker or the license plate. Right. Right. We need to make that text. So I, I did, I, all I did was unplug the, the right side or left side marker. That's other chassis. We have the GPS tracking products. So uh, the other the Revere chassis here does what I call address level GPS. It tells you that a unit went from address one to address two with a truck connected to it. But it only gives tracking with the tractor and that has to have power. So if the units move within an address to a new parking spot by just hooking up air to release the brakes, it doesn't see that. So if a fleet is just saying, I need to know where my assets are at, that's a good product. If they're trying to have drivers go exactly to where a, a chassis Specific, is yeah. every time, Easy Track Plus does that because it tells them every time the unit moves, where it moved, and it has its own backup battery to do it. Um, and then, so literally, simply, entry level, mid, full mounting. Right. And this health product is, uh, in some way, it's, it's a build your own solution. So if a fleet says, I have a tire problem, I want to solve my tire problem, then we just put tires on it. If they say, I need to solve lights, brakes, and tires and cover 80% of violations on an intermobile chassis, that's what you have here. 